Bill Murray has become the contemporary sufferer of a hack attack that has cost him a substantially giant quantity of $185,000, roughly 1 rupee and 50 pesi crore. Hollywood's celebrated comic and actor, Murray had hosted an NFT auction recently, proceeds of which had been supposed to be donated into charity. This amount used to be wrapped as 119.2 Ether units, all of which has is now lost. As phase of the auction, an NFT of a ticket to beer with Murray was once bought for ETH 119.2. This NFT is a 1-1 collectible phase of the actor's collection, created by using the Shack in partnership with Coinbase's NFT marketplace. Attend to the Shack underscore at Foshislami Grizlovit pick. Twitter.com slash 08 tac 4 coil The hacker used to be able to get away with the charity fund. The criminal's intentions have been to go past and steal non-fungible tokens belonging to Murray's private collections. As a shielding measure, Murray's pockets safety crew prevented the hacker from engaging in the difficult crime. Murray's pockets security crew from NFT consultancy project Venkman shortly moved his costly digital collectibles into a pair of protected residence wallets as soon as the assault was once detected. Coindisk said in its report. These at risk NFTs in Murray's wallet blanketed a Damien Hurst NFT, two CryptoPunks, a Pudgy Penguin, a Cool Cat, and several Flower Girls. While the brains at the back of this attack is but to be identified, the attacker has reportedly sent the stolen dollars to a wallet tackle tied to the crypto alternate Binance and Union Chain. AI. Meanwhile, a runner-up in the public sale named Mishap72 has replaced the misplaced cash and donated the sum to Chive Charities. A police file has been filed about this incident. Murray's team is additionally working with Chainlessis to song down the criminal. Chainlessis, a blockchain analytics firm, has launched its subsidiary dubbed Chainlessis Government Solutions, which aims to resource U.S. authorities' agencies in investigating crimes related to crypto. The new subsidiary will work with regulation enforcement and government agencies investigating cryptocurrencies, crook operations, and recovery of cash for victims.